Darling. Darling. Chief, you understand me? Oh, don't worry. I'm the ultimate master detective. I won't cause any trouble for you. That depends on the payment. I got... a bit lost. We haven't grown up at all. been waiting for you, my darling. I'm sorry, but I quit. Oi! I promise I'll figure out some way to pay you by tomorrow. Please wait just another two days. No, no, no a week. Wait for another week, please. It's not about the money. Take a look at this town. Everything's changed. Nobody wants detectives here. That's not true. The place has grown so big, it's just 
harder to see those in trouble. There are many people in need of our help. Where are they then? We haven't had a single customer for a month. If there's any trouble, just ask Amaterasu. They do everything, right? Why bother hiring a detective? But this is our town. If we don't protect it, who will? Our town? How long will you keep dreaming? This place belongs to Amaterasu now. But we promise we protect this town together! But protect it from what? Let the peacekeepers handle it. I hear that Amaterasu pays them pretty well. I'm hoping they'll interview me there soon. Yako, I, I, I feel bad saying this, but you should quit being a detective and find a proper job. What, you think this gig isn't proper? Yeah, that's right. In fact, I, I think you're out of your mind. Listen, you leave me alone from here on out. I don't want you dragging me down when I try to join the peacekeepers. Hey! <sighs> I'm all alone now. Hey there, Chief. When are you gonna pay your rent? Sorry, I'm gathering the money for that right now. You said that last week! And if you can't get me the money by today, I'll sell this place off to Amaterasu like I first planned. They'll pay a lot better than renting it out to you. I understand. I'll do something about it today. Actually, could you wait until the end of the month? Not a chance! Jeez. Are you with the Nocturnal Detective Agency? Yes? I'm looking for this person. I'll put a down payment of 100,000. If you find the target and bring her to me, it'll be one million. How about it? A million? I'll do it! Please give me this job! The woman currently works at a lab for Amaterasu Corporation. Amaterasu again? That's annoying. Is there a problem? If so, I can find someone else. No, there's no problem. Yeah, screw Amaterasu, am I right? Wonderful. Contact me once you find that woman. Understood. I'm... Just for my reference, what do you do with the gal once I find her? You'd be better off not getting too nosy. A million covers six months worth of rent. Luck is back on my side. I better start on the job right away. That's the woman. <sighs> Excuse me. What nice weather we're having. <laughs> it's raining? 
Oh, uh, uh I like the rain. <sighs> yeah. Fine, here's the truth. I'm a detective. Someone hired me to search for you. Ah, uh, got it. I think I know why. I probably know your client, too. So, are you going to contact him? I'll go right now if you want. Wait! Damn it. What am I doing? I should have just called the client right away. Um, who is my client? He didn't seem like the usual sort. I, uh, I work as a detective because I want to protect the city. I can't work for him if he's a criminal or something. Even if he's my client. <laughs> Are you laughing? Hey, I'm dead serious about my job. Sorry, I was just contemplating how your head must be full of rust. I'll take that as a compliment? It wasn't one. Well, I suppose an antique has its own charms. Antique? Your client is from our lab's rival organization. He's probably a headhunter. It's not uncommon. I get offers like this all the time. Some try more forceful methods, such as hiring a detective. Oh, because you're a researcher at Amaterasu. That's right. To be honest, it's not that great of a place. My boss is an ass, and my colleagues are all depressed. When their own research doesn't go well, they yell and throw mugs at me. Just the other day... Anyway, if my research is successful, it'll open a whole new field in regenerative medicine. It's still ongoing, but so far, it can repair nerve cells by simply ingesting medication. Do you understand how incredible that is? Do you see? Yeah, uh, I don't know about all this. Are you really supposed to tell me what you're researching? Shouldn't that stuff be kept secret? I'd really love to avoid getting dragged into a weird mess. Oh no. Well, whatever. Just make sure you don't tell anyone else. You should be good at that if you're a detective, right? Of course. Well, then, will you also keep quiet about where I am? Yes, of course. Wait, hold on! You're asking me to lie to my client? That's entirely different. How so? You could just say you never found me. This is my job. It'd be one thing if he was a criminal or something, but a headhunter. There's no reason for me to keep quiet. My livelihood is on the line. A million, a million is on the line. And I say I don't like it. Can't you respect my wishes? I live in this town. You said you wanted to protect us, so why don't you start with protecting me? Well, uh, hold on. I work for Amaterasu because I'm from this town. I wanted to stay here, so I chose to work for them. I don't want to go anywhere else. If you're from around here, then you should feel the same way. You were born here as well? Will you really sell me out for some cash? Or will you protect your fellow citizen, born in the same town? Which part is your real work, Mr. Detective? <sighs> I knew I shouldn't have spoken with her. After hearing all that, is there any possible way I could sell her out? Is that something a detective would do? All right, I'll leave you be. But you said you're not happy at your current workplace, yeah? In that case, I think you should really consider his offer. No matter what comes my way, 
I have no plans to change my mind. I love this town. Yeah. I also love this place. It's why I work as a detective. Damn it! My million! You... You're... I found you! Watch out! Get out of here now! That's not the sort of headhunting I'd imagined! You bastard! I won't let you have your way in this town! I'm the only detective Kanai Ward's got! You got that? Guess this is the last chance I'll have to enjoy the scenery. I heard your detective agency was here. Are you okay? You're hurt. Do I look okay to you? I'm hurting all over thanks to you. I lost my pay? And now I'm being forced to cover the damages to that cafe. All my friends are gone. I have nothing left. Well... Um... I'm sorry. Why are you here? The clients, long gone. I have no business with you. Why do you insist on being a detective? Even if you're doing it for the city's sake, aren't you getting tired of it? When I was a kid, I'd gather with all the neighborhood kids and play detective. I loved it. I made matching badges for my friends and we went around patrolling. I was so proud to wear it on my chest. I let it get to my head. I said our group of detectives would protect this town. It's been decades. But I still can't bring myself to lie to my childhood friends. Kanai Ward is going through some major changes. All the more reason why we need detectives here. So, I've decided to continue being the only one. You haven't grown up at all. That's... Thanks for protecting me earlier. You know... More people may be coming after me. So I'd like to make you an offer, Mr. Detective. How would you like to work as my bodyguard? I knew this day would come. Thank goodness for my research. This medicine can regenerate nerve cells. It's still in development, but I suppose I can leave a sample behind. It might be completed if someone takes over my research. It may even regenerate zombified brain cells. Look at you. Protecting me. Thanks. My sweet detective. You've done well. If the medication doesn't help, 
Maybe you'd feel better if you saw me again, hmm? <sighs>